Hello everybody. In this video, I will show you how to create a system message in SAP or how to send messages directly to a SAP user. I will start with the system message. A system message is displayed to every user as soon as they log into the SAP system. This is important, for example, if you want to inform all logged in users quickly. To do this, go to the menu, Tools, Administration, Administration, and double click on the transaction SM02. Or you can start directly the transaction SM02. Left, go to the icon Create and type a message Attention, we will restart the system. In 10 minutes. Please log off. Here you can choose whether the system message should appear only on certain application servers in the SAP system or on certain clients. You can also define the validity of the message or set when the message should no longer appear or be deleted. So the yes, we'll, this is okay. The system message is displayed immediately after the login onto the SAP system. You can also see which SAP user created this system message. This is very useful to inform all SAP users for important messages. Here we see our system message and we reload the window and here it is, the system message, the user and the message itself. Okay, then the next possible option is using a function module. For this, we start the transaction SE37 and we use the function module TH underscore pop up. With this one, you can easily and quickly send a message to another SAP user execute. Now we type in our client, the user who sends the message, in our case my own user, then the message, attention, please log off, and the other two input fields, they are okay. Then execute, and here is the message. You see the message, the send user, and there is uppercase. The message is in uppercase. If we don't want this, we can check this box, uppercase, lowercase, and we try this again with in case sensitive. Attention, please log off and execute. And our message is now case sensitive. Um, another very convenient and simple way to send messages in SAP are short messages. Um, to do this, simply select the uh, short message entry under system in the menu bar, so pick system, short message, and the window opens in which you can simply specify the title, tension, then the message, this is a 
message and a recipient. Um, when creating a so short message, you have the option to specify several recipients types. It is also possible to send an express message. I type my logged my SAP logon name and I check the box for express message. So then I send it. I restart or reload my window. And here it is the express message with the title and the username. Another way is uh, to open the SAP Business Workplace. Here you can see your inbox, your received messages, and your sent messages. Uh, here's a, here's a, a mistake I see. We, we delete this. The second one. This. And here we can also create a new message. We type the title. Another message, body. This is a message. And as, as I showed before, the recipient. It's my SAP logon name. And here again, I check the express message and I send my message. I reload my window and here it is, message and user. Especially SAP users who work daily with the system can be reached quickly. This can be very practical if someone in the system, for example, locks an object. Yeah, uh, I hope I could you give some tips regarding the messages in SAP and I would also be happy about a visit to my other videos. See you soon.